When it comes to defining luxury and grandeur, super yachts have definitely got the spot. These marine marvels are owned by the super rich who casually float in turquoise waters all around the world. We know that a yacht is a visually appealing and beautiful boat that represents class and status. But what exactly is a super yacht? How are they built? And what exactly is it that makes them super? Let's uncover what you need to know about super yachts from design and construction to the features and cost. So without any further delay, let's get started. Welcome to Quality Time for Men, where time is the ultimate currency. So the very first thing that comes to mind is, what exactly is a super yacht? A super yacht, often known as a mega yacht, is a professionally crewed luxury sailing vessel. It has a load line length of 79 feet or more with distinct technical features that set it apart from the average boat. If it extends beyond that, the yacht is already classified as a super yacht. One of the largest super yachts in the world is the Azam super yacht, which has been designed by Lursen Yachts. This yacht is 591 feet long and has been on the water since April 2013. This super yacht is currently owned by Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nayan, the current president of the United Arab Emirates. The super yacht is believed to cost more than 600 million to build. Azam is currently on the Red Sea. Azam's upkeep costs roughly 60 million each year. Now that we know about the super yacht, let's have a look at the super yacht's features. First, let's talk about the crystal interiors. The yachting lifestyle frequently lends itself to extravagance, and on certain occasions, a few onboard interiors are built to dazzle with artistic use of crystals and stones. The 28 meter, which is 92 feet, Motor Yacht Cadet V from Illumin is the newest super yacht to acquire a beautiful Swarovski crystal masterpiece from Stefano Carto. The stylish eye catcher is placed on the forward wall of the main salon for guests to appreciate as it catches the sunlight. Another feature of these yachts are the dive centers. Some luxury super yachts are also constructed for ocean health research. Few have diving centers as remarkable as Samaya, which was delivered late in 2017 and was developed to explore some of the world's most isolated places. The facility has all of the required amenities, including a nitrox-enriched air system, which is finished with a high-quality teal floor and metallic and wooden ceiling. Glass-bottom pools is another feature that is being found on many yachts. Light and water are two key components of living on a super yacht, and the swimming pool or jacuzzi is usually at the focal point of any external deck. The 52-meter, 171-foot, seven sins, constructed by Italian shipbuilders San Lorenzo, features a glass-bottomed swimming pool on the upper deck, which spotlights the beach club below. The collection of super yachts with helipads is long, which is another feature of these super yachts. But some of the top 200 largest boats are taking the concept to the next level, such as the 85.5-meter Oceanco Sunrays, which has a matching color scheme for its whirlybird and the 88-meter Lursing Quattro L, which has an unmistakable paint job for its popular EC-135 Eurocopter. Now, what do we know about the super yacht crew? An unusual super yacht crew consists of five different areas. The captain, who has responsibility for all the operations on the yacht. The chef, who is in charge of all food. Interior staff, who strive to provide a hotel-like surroundings. And the deck crew, which operates and maintains the vessel. To ensure the full and proper operation of many systems, the yacht engineers are also on board. All of the crew members are paid a solid monthly income, with the owner covering nearly all living expenses. Those who reside on board do not have to pay for food, rent, energy, or water. If we talk about the crew accommodations, then these are standard on all super yachts and typically include a crew mess, crew cabins, and a washroom. On larger super yachts, captains and chief engineers typically have their own cabins. Crew members do not work regular hours. Rather, they may be asked to work at various times based on a variety of factors, such as how frequently the owner is on board and whether the yacht is chartered. This can result in extremely lengthy workdays, but the well-paying nature of the job is often thought to make this desirable. What about their cost and who can afford them usually? Super yachts can cost millions of dollars to buy, with the most luxury vessels costing more than 500 million. A super yacht's price is determined by criteria such as its size, design, materials utilized, and level of luxury. When it comes to designing a super yacht, there's so much to look for. A yacht's design must consider its intended function, such as whether it will be utilized for racing, 
cruising, or commercial purposes. The yacht's size, weight, and material must all be carefully evaluated because they will affect its efficiency and reliability. On average, it takes about three to four years to build a yacht. Espen Oino is a Norwegian yacht designer who has created some of the world's largest and most expensive super yachts. He is the creator and lead designer of Espen Oino International, a Monaco-based yacht design firm. The designer has created approximately 200 boats, several of which are among the world's largest and most technologically advanced. Other than Oino, Carlo Luvenari and Dan Lennard are other designers who formed Luvenari Lennard, which is an Italian architecture and design studio. The studio was built in 1998. They are well known for creating luxury boats, super yachts, and mega yachts, as well as private aircraft and homes. They have collaborated with a number of famous shipyards and yacht builders, including Lurson, Oceanco, and Palmer Johnson. Terence Disdale Design is a London-based luxury design and architecture firm that specializes in high-end residential, commercial, and hospitality projects. Terence Disdale launched the firm in 1973, and it has since built a reputation for developing elegant, timeless interiors and exteriors for luxury houses and super yachts all around the world. There are some different kinds of yachts that we'd like to explain here for your better understanding. These yachts include Apo Yacht, Nord Yacht, and Black Pearl Yacht, etc. Let's take a look at what these yachts actually are. The first one that we're going to talk about is the Apo Super Yacht. Apo is a motor yacht that measures 115.1 meters in total length. The boat was built by Lursen Yachts in Germany and was launched in 2021. The beam of the super yacht is 18.3 meters, the draft is 4.3 meters, and the volume is 5,257 GT. The super yacht Apo can accommodate up to 16 guests and also has space for 36 crew members, including the captain. The hull of Apo is made with steel and the superstructure is made with aluminum. It is propelled by two MTU engines and has a top speed of 18 knots. Another world's largest sailing yacht, Black Pearl, stands at 350 feet and is thought to have cost more than 200 million. The three-mast yacht, delivered in 2018 by Dutch builder Oceanco, is believed to be the realization of her owner's bold ambition, who wanted to build something that was out of the ordinary in every way, according to the captain. The yacht's groundbreaking design Echo credentials and technological advancements gained global attention, creating a new industry benchmark and achieving numerous awards for innovation. There is another yacht that has blown everyone's mind. It's the Kismet Yacht. Kismet, an award-winning 95-meter super yacht, is the ideal entertainment vessel for entertaining friends and family. The goal was to build a mega yacht with cutting-edge engineering that was delivered in 2014. Not one, but two helicopter pads are available on it and a private observation platform with an outdoor bed designed for stargazing that can be closed off to other guests and employees. On this yacht, the sun deck features a swimming pool with an integrated jacuzzi, and the pool's ingeniously constructed aft end doubles as the lift shaft's skylight. And that's all for this video, guys. Let us know in the comments which of these yachts you would like to travel on if you get the opportunity. If you enjoyed watching this video, then hit the like button and subscribe to the channel Quality Time for Men. Elevate your time. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.